Hello, my name is Longtrader, and today I'll be telling you about Britain's longest serving V bomber, the Hanley Page Victor. If you find this video informative or enjoyable today, please do subscribe. The story of the Hanley Page HP 80 Victor has its roots in Britain's atomics weapons program. In 1946, the USA banned the share of knowledge of atomic weapons, forcing the British to develop their own weapons. At the same time, the air staff issued specifications for a new heavy bomber to replace the aging Avro Lancaster. Hanley Page Limited, a company familiar with heavy aircraft like bombers and airliners, responded to the request with plans for a new bomber called the HP-80. First flying in December 1952, the HP-80 Victor was one of the most advanced designs in the air. It had a revolutionary crescent-shaped wing, subsonic capabilities, and a 35,000-pound bomb load. The Victor could carry one 10-ton Grand Slam earthquake bomb or any other bomb load for up to 7,000 kilometers. Interestingly enough, it carried no defensive weapons. This was because at the time it was designed, it would have been one of the fastest aircraft in the air. The crescent wing gave it a high cruise speed and lower drag. Entering service in 1956, the Victor had been slightly redesigned from the prototype. The bomber had now been retrofitted with sophisticated electronic countermeasures. It was also now nuclear capable and could be either armed with Britain's first operational atomic weapon, the Yellow Sun, or America's Mark V strategic atomic bomb. In 1965, several Victor B Mark IIs were retrofitted with reconnaissance equipment, followed by several Mark Is being converted to aerial tankers to replace the aging Vickers Valiant tankers. The Valiants were being retired due to wing fatigue from low-level operation. The bomber Victors retired in 1968, but the aerial tankers remained in service until 1993. In a funny turn of events, in 2009, a Victor named Teasing Tina was doing a high-speed taxi when it leaped off the runway, obtaining a short 11-second flight. She is only one of four victors left. If you enjoyed this video today, please leave a like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.